Hey YouTube, it's Brooklyn, and today I'm going to be showing you my piercings and tattoos. So I have 9 tattoos, and then I have 23, 24 piercings, depending on if you count each hole as a piercing. So what I'm going to be showing you first is the swallows on my hips, and then I got these about 2 months ago. And some of these have gotten so old, I actually don't remember the time frame. And then the one right here in the middle of my chest, that is a Sailor Moon tattoo, so that one I really love. And then I have this one for my father right here, which the skulls have waves in them. And then my second tattoo that I do remember as a kid is the one on the back of my neck. That is a Gemini symbol that I drew when I was younger. So... The next one after that is actually my first tattoos in the middle, and then around it is F holes. They're made out of music notes. I love this one, but honestly, that was painful. Very painful for me. So next, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see very well because how I have to have my camera be to be able to see everything. So next is I have my piece on my hip right here which I'll be showing you in just a minute so let me zoom in. So this is a piece that I have on my hip which is my dream catcher which is very large. I love this piece. Um, I actually kind of threw it all together. My tattoo artist really did help me throw it all together. Draco sitting there playing so but um, I got this all at once and then I added the ribbons later on to make it go down further. And then my second actually this is my third tattoo ever was on my foot which is very lovely and it has the Inuasha band if you guys if any of you watch Inuasha that's the band that he wears around his neck when Kagome says sits boy and then the last tattoo that I have to show is my Herulean Triforce with the Master Sword from Ocarina of Time and little Navi right there so this I got when I was actually still in high school it was my last year in there so I really love this piece. Now back to my face. Alright, so I'm also going to be, because I got this remote, so you all see that I'm trying to, you're jumping into different spaces. So that is going to be really awesome and easier transitions. So next I'm going to be showing you some of my piercings because I can't show all of them. So I got all the ones I have along my ear. I got my triguses all along here. And then on my other side I have my rook, my cart cartilage. And the piercing is long here, and as you can see in my face, I got my nose pierced, my septum, my lip, and my tongue. And then I also have my dermal, or not dermal, my, ta my, piercer, my piercer doesn't let me call it dermal, but it is a surface piercing more of all. And what that is, is they actually poke a hole into your skin, and the back piece actually goes under your skin and your skin heals and they will never permanently heal but you, they can stay in for a year maybe longer than that they're not permanent piercings at all and they do end up rejecting so let's move on to the belly button piercings I have I have a double belly button here and with them I have to have extra short bars in them because I don't have very much skin in between which is not the ideal for me, but you know, when I, I got them when I was young, the piercer didn't end up piercing it right. And then I also have my bottom done. So these are the two piercings that I have here. Now those are all my piercings and tattoos that I have. And the dream catcher, that's family, because I do have Cherokee and Blackfoot Indian in me, and that was for my grandfather who passed away a year, about almost a year and a month ago. And then Triforce was for the fact that I played it when I was a child. And then someone that I grew up with who I watched playing Zelda all the time. And then Sailor Moon, me. And then the anime piece of me, music, because music honestly did bring me out of depression and anxiety when I was younger. So that was a plus. And then my father. So those are a little bit of explanations about them. And then the swallows set me free and a lot to do with my past and growing up. So those are my piercings and tattoos. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And love you guys. Mwah. And also, if you like this video and how editing and how different my videos are just going to be starting to get and you liked it, make sure you have a thumbs up. If you want to know more about my piercings and tattoos and stuff, comment below or ask me on Tumblr. They are in my main profile. You'll find them in the About Me. So I hope everybody has a great and fantastic day once again. Bye.